everyone, this is G Friday. Today is a Sunday. It's the 4th of June, and uh, it's a beautiful Sunday morning here in Seattle. Happy Sunday, everyone. Uh, today, we're going to be doing a reaction video, but it's a little bit different. Uh, I normally react to like music videos and uh, commercials, but today, I'm going to do a uh, two-part reaction to a, uh, a movie. A, a movie that, from the Philippines, of course, that's been going around the uh, film festival circuit. Uh, it won the, the best actress uh, for the, the, the leading actress, Jacqueline Jose, from the Philippines, of course, uh, at the Cannes uh, Film Festival just uh, last year. So it's a big deal, artsy type of a movie, not one of those big blockbuster Hollywood movies, but um, yeah, it'd be just these art movies just really focus on uh, real lives of Filipinos in the Philippines, of course. So, uh, definitely looking forward to this. So, I said two parts because I'm going to be reacting to the trailer right now. And uh, later on, I'm going to get a chance to watch the actual movie. So, um, let me explain myself. Uh, from, and let me just pull this out. So, I'm wearing a different shirt today. This is my shirt, my volunteer shirt for the Seattle International Film Festival. So yes, this film festival has been happening in Seattle from uh, the 18th of May up until the 11th of June, up until next Sunday. So it's very, very, very cool because uh, typically there's a, a number of films from the Philippines that are being shown during these large film festivals. And the Seattle International Film Festival, I'll, I'll put their link down below, but the Seattle International Film Festival is one of the largest film festivals here in the United States. So, but this year, 2017, there's only one movie from the Philippines, and that is Ma Rosa, uh, directed by Brillante Mendoza, and starring uh, an amazing Filipino veteran actress, Jacqueline Jose. And of course, like I said earlier, she won the Best Actress at the Cannes in National Film Festival as well. So, let me just show you this. This is uh, the whole lineup of the Seattle International Film Festival. And like I said, I'll put their links down below. You still have a whole week uh, if you want to just catch a movie or so with the film festival. Again, it's really, really worth it. Now, yesterday, I was volunteering for the film festival. And after two hours of volunteering, you get a one of these. I got a free voucher. So I'm going to exchange this free voucher later on because at 1 p.m. today, um, Ma Rosa is playing, and I'm going to exchange this for a free ticket. And after that, I'm going to give you my reaction to the movie. But for now, let's look at the official trailer of Ma Rosa, and let's, you know, let's see what it's about. Here we go. Okay, so this is uh, Jacqueline Jose. And from what I read, she's a mother that owns a Sari Sari store, which is a Filipino version of a convenience store. And because of the hardships in life, uh, she was forced to sell drugs. And this sort of looks at her, not adventures, but her, her um, the whole thing when she needed to deal with corrupt uh, government officials and police. And it looks very edgy. It looks like looking for something this trailer and of course the handcuffs being taken away oh my goodness that is really scary it says rosa sari sari store sari sari store is a filipino version of Para matapos ito. Libo. what the police said just to get this done they wanted uh 200,000 pesos wow that's a huge amount of money whoa it looks Simple lang yan. 50 mil. Kulang pa ng ispang 50 mil. It's a trailer lang. Oh! It looks so dark and seedy. Oh my god. Oh my god. Someone's getting beaten up. Wow. CD. So, yeah, looking forward to this. Like I said, later on, I'll give you my feedback after watching the movie. Hey guys, uh, so just want to show you the theater that was showing La Rosa today. Right behind me, this is the Art Lodge at uh, Columbia City here in Seattle. Um, a fairly small theater, 
But uh, yeah, that's where I think um, a lot of the UCL National Film Festival are like uh, doing their films like in scattered locations in downtown Seattle, as well as there's also one location in Bellevue. But this Art Lodge was where Ma Rosa was showing and then for tomorrow, Monday, um, they'll be somewhere else. But yeah, that was an awesome experience in there. I volunteered here yesterday and then, of course I got to see a, a free film today. So that is awesome. This is how I'm spending my Sunday afternoon. Hey guys, so it's uh, a beautiful day, so I decided to just uh, sit on a bench here at uh, Columbia Park. Um, the, yeah, the, the music that you can hear right behind me, and I mean just pan around a bit, uh, right over here, it's, um, they're actually having a, uh, a honk fest. Um, so I guess like all the uh, wind instruments, trumpets and whatnot, they're just like, you know, playing around in this park, so it's pretty cool. Uh, people are just out relaxing, enjoying the sun, same as me. Again, 
Green flavor is toothpaste. Dirty flavor is berry blue. Here we go. <laughs> I couldn't taste the difference because it's a dud. It's actually toothpaste flavor. But the reason, like I said, I just brushed my teeth so my whole mouth uh, tastes like toothpaste anyways. And uh, this just blended in really well. I'm not going to try to finish this one. Alright guys, uh, if I don't see you later on, then please, if you enjoy this reaction video, leave me a big thumbs up, click on the like button. If you want to leave me positive and constructive comments, please do it down below. And of course, click on that subscribe button. Have an awesome, awesome Sunday, and this is G Friday. Ciao!